technology and the funding to use it. That's what will help North Carolina Central University preserve history. So the school received one of four Getty Images photo archive grants for HBCUs, and this money will allow NC Central to digitize about 50,000 photographs. WRAL's Monica Casey shows us what this means for the university. These photos are worn down by time, some torn, a few faded, others stained, but they're being made whole again thanks to new technology. The grant from Getty Images and equipment from Epson and AdNet Global allows archivists to restore NC Central's history. I was ecstatic about it. Library director Dr. Theodosia T. Shield says the digitization educates the world about NCCU's contributions and it makes African American history accessible. Some of the photos date back to the early 1900s. Others feature Black Wall Street in Durham and historical figures visiting the school. It's in a digital format and, you know, everybody has a digital device. So you have this history at your fingertips and it's an education experience, not only for African Americans, but for the country and the world to know what about the many contributions we have made. NC Central history major Alejandro Ibrahim is one of the students sifting through the stack of pictures. Like a dream come true, I get to actually work on the content of the university I attend so I get to see the history of where this university started and where we've gone. He tells me participating in the project is inspirational. Especially the black male, you know, seeing the images of successful men it encourages me to encourage other people through organizations such as the African American Male Initiative to help those um, achieve their goals. Okay, so far, NC Central believes there are about 50,000 items that they need to digitize. Some include never-before-seen film, which is pretty interesting. Yeah. They're going to hope the project is long-term and they can do some training and use the equipment to digitize more work in the future.